Hello. Good night, everybody. Hi, good evening. Good evening. How are you tonight? Hi, teacher. Hi. How are you tonight? Fine. I'm very, very fine. Mm. <laughs> I don't know. You're so happy. What's going on? <laughs> Like, so, so very fine. <laughs> That's great. Good vibes. Great. <laughs> okay. Um, how was your day? Is it hot in the cellular right now? So, it's the heat is hot. Yes. Yes, yeah, it's very hot in the cellular. Okay. Tell me. Todavía tengo problemas con la plataforma. Yo no me he podido conectar, pero igual ya ya estuve. Hablando con las personas ahí encargadas todo el día. Uh -huh. Y ya mañana tengo una respuesta. Porque no tengo acceso a la plataforma. Me dio un error y no me dejó entrar. Ah, lo bloqueó, creo. Me cuenta, a ver sí. si lo resuelve mañana. Oye. Katia. Buenas tardes. De, de oyente y de Hello. Viviente. Oyente y viviente. <risa> <risa> Vea nuestro futuro también, de paso. <risa> Mr. Ángel Castillo, welcome. Hello. Thank you, teacher. Everything good? Katia, welcome. Yeah. Heidi. Thank you, teacher. Welcome, Hello. Juan Carlos Cervellón. Juan Carlos. Hello. I'm going to have Hello. Juan Carlos Hello. Cervellón, and the other one is going to be JC, okay? Okay. You're going to be JC, all right. Good evening. Turn the camera on if you can. All right, welcome. So, tonight, oh my gosh, I don't want to scream. Okay, tonight we're going to be working on um, indirect questions. It's time for us to practice. We're going to do the exercise first and then practice speaking using indirect questions. So when did we say we use indirect questions for? Or what do we use it for? Do you remember? Yes. When do we use it? Katia, remember? Why is it that we go through all of this trouble of changing the structure that we already know to make a question? But the reason is because we want to be, in order to be polite. Would you? To be polite, okay? Forget, let's do the exercise. Everybody go to section 2.8, please. Ready? Okay. All right, Mr. Angel Castillo, number, number one. Wow. Uh, so the listening activity from the video as were the following question. Could you tell me where the nearest ATM is? Oh, okay. Yes, did you get these answers? Because that was based on the on the listening. I'm gonna mute everyone. Okay, if you need to participate, if you want to participate, um, turn the microphone on, all right? Very good, so what is the answer for number one? Help me out. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to play the audio for you again. No idea? And number one, it's Start across from the dirty free shot. It's the first one. All right. Very good. Number two, Mr. Arnold Cuello. Oh, no, you don't have it. You have to listen to this. Okay, Heidi, number two. How often do the buses room? They room every 20 minutes or so. Every 20 minutes or so, okay. Number three. Katya, I think? No. Yes, Katya, I don't hear you. 
there now oh. number three uh, here I didn't I don't have idea you don't have any idea no <laughs> all right <laughs> yeah what you have to do is go back to the to the video and see the video the mm -hmm. yes exactly yeah. <laughs> so let me see who finished this part do you want to listen to that part again me finish you finished who else finished Kathy, you didn't. I I do you did What's your name? I did. JC. Ah, right. Um, Miguel Angel, did you finish this part? Hello. Hi, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry for too late. I'm too late. <laughs> for being late. Did you yeah. finish section 2.8? Uh, no. No. Sorry. Majority, I know. No, I think the majority hasn't finished. Um, so maybe we're going to listen to this part just one more time, okay, and then practice the, the majority. You know what? No. Um, hold on. Okay, this I will ask you to do as homework because it's going to take too long, all right? Do it as homework, section 2.7. Please watch the video and answer the question, all right? Now, I want us to practice. In, hold on. All right, so I'm gonna send, I'm gonna send an image to WhatsApp. Everybody go to WhatsApp, please. I'm gonna send you uh, this image. Hold on. Oh my gosh, it's so hot here. Mm -hmm. Right, everybody access it and I'm sending it right now. So we're going to work with the indirect question. The first one says, all right, open, open it and the first one says, who is your best friend? Look at this. Who is your best friend? This is a regular question, right? Who is your best friend? Okay, but I want you to use, could you tell me? Okay, I want you to use this expression. So if I want to change it to indirect, how would it be? Could you tell me? Could you tell me, uh -huh. tell me who your best friend is? Yes, yeah. that is right. So number one would be, could you tell me who your best friend friend is so follow the structure right you have the expression expression plus um wh or if if it is a yes no question and then you have the subject and finally you have the verb right this is a structure we're gonna follow number two what is the question guys check check what's up What's the question, the second one? It says, how old are you? How old are you? All right, so that's the question number two. How old, that's question number two. How old are you? How do we make this question in direct? Could you tell me? Could you tell me how old are you? How old? All right, look, this is the expression. Could you tell me? Could you tell me how old? Uh, now we need the subject. What uh, is the subject? You. Yes. You are. Exactly. That is the correct question. Could you tell me how old you are? Okay. I want you to modify all the questions and on top of that, discuss them. We're going to work in groups. Let's do one more. I want to give you an example with if. Um, do no, you have any pets? Do you have any bad habits? Okay, for example. Yeah, thank you. Do you have any pets? Okay, this is a yes, no question. So we're going to use, this is the structure, right? Let me highlight it. We're going to use if for yes, no question. So do you have any pets? How do I make it an indirect question, guys? 
Could you tell me? Could you tell me? Uh -huh. WH or if? If you have. Yes, the question would be, could you tell me if you have any pets? Pets. Okay. Yes. So we're going to use if because it's a yes, no question. We're going to use WH when it's a WH question. Is that clear? Okay. Are you ready? Okay. I'm going to give you an example of what we're going to be doing. So let me see. Hold on, hold on. I want to practice with Jenny. Yeah. Okay. Imagine I'm working with Jenny. I'm going to say, Jenny, could you tell me how many languages you speak? Could you tell me how many languages you speak? How many languages? Jenny, you need to answer the question, guys. Okay. Right now, only one. <laughs> one and a half. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I want you to ask the question and, and give the answer, all right? So, like a natural conversation. Enjoy it, guys. Enjoy the, the conversation, all right? Do you have questions? Questions? No? No. Ready? Let's practice then, okay? Accept the invitation. Question. Yes, tell me. You eliminate the auxiliary verb. Uh, yes, the auxiliary. Yes, you don't need the auxiliary anymore. Okay, always. Yes, follow the, the okay. structure. Exactly. Oh, okay. you know what, guys? Hold on. I was about to create it, but here I'm going to write this because you can say, for example, how old how many languages, right? You can add a little bit more information to the WH question like this. How many languages you speak? So before we say you speak, we're saying how many languages, all right? Anything else, other question? No? Are you ready? Yes. yes. Ask and answer the yeah. questions. Ask the invitation, here we go. Tell me, Could you tell me how you spend your free time. How you, how you tell, tell me how you spend your free time. Could you okay. tell me how you spend your free time? All right, what is the answer? Everybody discuss. Hey, how do you, how, can you tell me how you spend your free time? I spend my free time watching Netflix. <laughs> <laughs> but what do you watch? Series? A series. What, tell me one of them. Uh, the Fall. Uh-huh, interesting. Uh, a mur murder, uh -huh. asesino. Yes, a murderer. Very handsome. <laughs> <laughs> or an assassin, you can say as well. <laughs> That's why you want to. Jenny, what about you? 
Could you tell me how you spend your free time, Jenny? Jenny, you're muted. Hi, I spend my free time uh, the same with Heidi. I like to um, see, uh, watch series and I like to listen to music. Okay, very um, good. Yes, discuss the questions, all right? If you can, try to turn the cameras on, okay? Because Heidi is, feels a little lonely, right, Heidi? Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's weird. <For> me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I there have you are. A problem. <laughs> okay, Heidi, here's Jenny and, and Juan Carlos. All right, continue. I told you are. Uh -huh. Juan Carlos. Could you tell uh, us how tall you are? Can, uh, can you, could you? No, but tell also, also uh, discuss and give the answer. So, for example, I am a 164 uh, okay. centimeters tall. Uh -huh. That's I my am 30, 34 years old. No, no, no. How, how tall? tall? Uh, oh, your height. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I am. Mm, one meter um, uh, 70, uh, 70, uh, 70 uh, five uh -huh. centimeters. Yeah. centimeters all right and you are yeah. and you are not Arnold where he's not here All right, continue and, and discuss, okay? Okay. It's like, como pronósticos. Mm -hmm. I have that forecast. And I, uh, I do purchase orders. And I purchase orders. Yes, I, mm. I'm, a, I'm a man alive. I'm a buyer. And I, um, I do... Uh, forecasting and you do forecast reports sorry you do forecast reports no i i do a forecasting of demand ah yes you do the forecast the demand forecast. yes i need i need to do a, a to do that for after that i may a purchase order According right. to the to their results. Uh huh. Yes, or based on the results. <coughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, who's the made the next question? Okay. Whose turn is it? Take turns. Uh, how who mm, you tell me yeah all the all the, the questions about, the questions yeah. are are on whatsapp i said the the image oh uh, yeah you're supposed to be discussing those questions these look these are the ones uh, those are the number, questions number all uh, of them yeah, I sent it to what's... Ah, okay. Who's your best friend? Yes, could old you tell you? me who your best friend is? Could you tell me how old you are? Could you tell me what you do in your free time? So, transform the questions and then discuss them. Okay? Mm. Ah, yeah. Yeah, ah, okay. I see. Sorry, I, I connected uh, uh, a little late. <laughs> uh, I missed the instruction. <laughs> no, it's okay. Don't worry. <laughs> Either I don't have a voice. Only you. That question Only you. Go yeah. private, right? Hold on. Huh. I'm gonna send you a Jose Armando is going to come here. You tell me how. Hi, hey, Mr. JC. I had never seen Hi. you before. Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you. Yeah. It's awesome seeing you. Jose Armando is here. Hi, Jose. 
Tell me how. Try to include him, all right, on the question. Who you tell me? All right, continue. Okay. okay. The next. No, I am married. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 I don't. I I married. Okay. I'm married. You, Katya? I don't have. <laughs> I'm single. Single. Yay! Yay! What is Yay. it? If you're single, put your hands up. Yeah. <laughs> That's better, guys. It's better being single. Right, Katya? Right. Yeah. It's better. <laughs> All right. Next question. Let me hear. Yes. Uh, could you tell me what country have you visited? Mm. That, sorry, that's not an indirect Guatemala. question. You need to change the question. Could you tell me what countries you could you tell? Could you tell me visited? what country visit? No, you. You need. You need to uh, start with the subject. What could country? You tell me what countries you have visited? Have you visited? No, visited. that's a question. It's not. It's not supposed to be a question. Could you tell me what countries you have visited? You're changing the order of all of them. You have visited. Yes, like a statement, oh, yeah. not a question. Okay. okay, say it again. I only visit Guatemala. Mm -hmm. I've only visited. I visited uh, Mexico, Guatemala, and El Salvador. And you, uh, Juan Carlos? I, I, I don't have visit I haven't another visited country. I haven't visited another country. Other countries. Other country. Yes. Very good. Next question, whose turn is it? Um, Can you tell me what kind of food do you like? No, you don't use the auxiliary anymore. What kind of food you like? Like. Yes. Like. So we're changing it. When you use, could you tell me you need to change the structure completely and you say, I like, you like, you go, so you didn't go, you, you went. You need to use the affirmative or negative structure. I will explain that after you finish, but try to pay attention to that, okay? Who do you like? Uh, okay, could you don't tell use, me? Don't use the auxiliary, guys. What? Don't use the auxiliary. Yeah. Could you like? Could you tell me uh -huh. what, kind? what kind of food do you what? like? No. <laughs> you like. What you kind like. of food you like? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes, because you need okay. Expression, like. WH or if, and a statement, not a question anymore. Okay. Wait. What? I like to. Uh, I like. Uh, <coughs> if, if bless you. you. Have, bless you. Thank you. <laughs> Can you I tell see. me if? Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. You have to be very careful. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I the have virus. this virus. <laughs> the virus is it's the the coronavirus. Yes, the <laughs> subject of the moment. <laughs> yeah. Right. Trending topic. The coronita. Be yeah. careful. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, continue. Yes, it's it's safer. Uh, uh, How many languages do you speak? You speak. You speak. Yes, very good. Uh, one and a half. Uh, <laughs> I speak I, one and a half. 
I speak two languages. Two languages. What are they? Mentira. Mentira. <laughs> 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 you know what you can say I speak um Spanish and basic English or intermediate English. That counts, it counts. Okay, the rest of you I speak Spanish and a little English and I can American signal language. Oh, really? A little. A little? Yes. Okay, are you studying or you stop studying? Are, are you still studying American sign language? Or not anymore? I just studied. I just studied. Oh, in the past. In all right, interesting. I, I speak some in the past. I speak some Portuguese and French, but you know, beginner, intermediate. <laughs> All right, next question. We're almost done. Okay. What about you, Angel? Um. Uh. uh eight. Eight months ago, I started uh, study English. You start mm. to study two months ago. Yes. Okay, or I've online? been studying English. Uh -huh, tell us. Online. Yes, uh, online. No, online. I started two weeks ago or a week midly. Uh, a week and a half. Okay. No, online. A week and online. a half. Yeah. Online, right. I'm been studying um, like three months ago. No. Uh, okay. When you use present perfect, you don't use, you're not time specific. So I started past three months ago, or I have studied for three months. For okay. three months. And three months ago is past. Four three months is present perfect. Okay. So On, only three months. Uh -huh, so okay. I have studied for three months. Okay. okay thank you. I'll say it again. Okay. I've been studying uh, for three months. Right. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay. But where where else did you study, Mr. Noy? Um, in the university of El Salvador, and, and I been, <clears throat> I was studying in Academia Europea for six months. No, I studied. Okay, I yes. studied. What about you, Mr. Castillo? Did you study somewhere else? No, no. This is your Only. first time. Yes, my first time. Oh, really? Yes. Wow. That's a very technological way of learning. <laughs> yes, yeah. it's very good. And it's working for you, huh? Great. You, mm -hmm. Miguel Angel, did you ever study somewhere else? Um, I studied in, in Safort uh, this middle year ago. In no, but not the not last year. Like, um, right. In the uh, middle of the year, like mid. Yeah, middle of the year. In the middle. Uh huh. Oh. I start in the middle. Right, in right. in Safort, a Colonia Escalón. Yes, I know. I, I know. Yeah. I I I used to teach there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Great. How many questions did you discuss? I think we're going to go back now. Um, uh, six questions. Okay, one more and we'll finish. Um, morning or night person. Uh, I am um, 
morning person. I am a night person. <laughs> Do you have a lot of energy during night? Mm -hmm. Katia? Excuse me, teacher. Do you have a lot of energy during the night? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. What time do you wake up? How do you the, say, no time? puedo madrugar? I cannot wake up early. Wake up early. Yes. <laughs> okay. How was the exercise, guys? Difficult, so so. So so. A little so, so. difficult, easy. What do you think? It's difficult so, for so. me. Yes, you know why? Um, okay, you need to please write the structure because we're going to practice some more, okay? But yes, you need the expression, as I said, all right? Then you need WH or if and some additional information, for example, how old, how many apples, how uh, different, okay? And finally, I would say you need a statement. Why? Because this could be confusing. Okay, help me. I'm going to try to explain this with examples. All right. Um, everybody help me. Give me a sentence, be it affirmative or negative, in the present form. Everyone, give me one example. One person, please. Tell me a question. A question, actually. No, a, a statement, sorry, a statement in affirmative or negative form. Um, I am Spanish. Uh huh. I'm studying English now. No, 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 but present simple. Ah, okay. I study uh, English at 8 p.m., right? That's an affirmative statement. Okay. Uh, tell me a negative statement in the past, guys. Pay attention because look at what I'm doing. Pay attention, everyone. Uh -huh. um, I didn't study French. I didn't study French. Okay. Very good. Uh, another person, example with present perfect. Katia, Angel Castillo, example with present perfect. I will give you one, all right? She has, we're only using study. She has studied for three months. Okay, so look, when I say statement, I mean this, affirmative or negative. You don't need the auxiliary, okay? Now, I'm going to make a question with this, all right? I will say, could you... Tell me, could you tell me um, what time you study English, right? So I don't need any auxiliaries. It's a statement. All right, the second one, how would you make a question here? Could you tell me why? I didn't study French, okay? So I don't need any auxiliaries, no uh, changes in the structure, nothing. Okay, and finally, I'm um, gonna say again, could you tell me you tell if, me? if she has studied for three months? Okay. So I don't change anything. Pay attention and try to do that. Do you have questions about this? Or are you ready to practice? Okay. Me, I guess, teacher. Yes, tell me. Um, 
if I <clears throat> if I use uh, do uh, I I can use it with do you know for example do, with do you yes do you but, for, for example but because do you know is the expression it, this part is is the green one okay it's the same one do you know so in that case you use the auxiliary and like could you tell me this is the question in reality okay then you have water if I'm gonna make it a different color so you see, because this is more than what's in the platform, all right? The platform is limited to, uh, to a tense, but this includes everything, guys. So look, this is the pink part, all right? And then the statement, oh, what time is the pink part? And then the statement is, um, okay. I'm gonna make it gray, like this you study English, like an affirmative statement. Okay, other questions? No more questions? Okay. Mm. If you no. want to, take a screenshot of this and send it to a group, please. Send it to WhatsApp. Anyway, we're going to practice right now. Okay, I will send you uh, this link for you to practice, but help me with the first one. Everyone, help me. So what her name is the question. Tell me, look, guys, all of this, tell me, please tell me, I want to know, you must tell me. All of these are expressions, different expressions, okay? So let's finish number one. Tell me. Uh-huh. What her name is. Tell me what her name is. Yes, that is correct. Okay, one more. Where is the cinema? Please tell me. Expression W H Where, where, yes. where what the cinema, cinema is. is. Where the, where cinema, the cinema is. Very is. good. Okay, so I will send you the link right now and you're going to work in pairs. Okay, mm, hold on. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna send you the link right now. Give me one second. But check this, okay? All right, I'm sending you the link. Please open the link and you're gonna work in pairs. So accept the, um, accept the invitation, please. Then. One second, I'm making the groups. Okay. Okay, accept the invitation, please, and check what's up, okay? Mr. Garcia, I sent the invitation. Juan Carlos Cervellón. Pierde más rápido. Sí. Eh, hey, ¿qué pasa? Teacher, the, the link when in a, a no open. Oh, really? Yeah. Um. To change open, but change a uh, uh, other oh, page. Other, other page. Yes, that's right. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take a picture then. I don't know what's going on. You're right. 
I'll send uh, pictures and, and discuss what the questions uh, are, okay? Hold on. Okay. Probably it's a virus, I don't know. Acabo de conseguir una imagen. Yes, I sent it. <laughs> I know, I know who sent it. And here's another one. Okay, thank you. All right. Okay. Very good. Start, please. The okay. Third. Where is the cinema? No. Ay, me fui, me fui donde no era. Please tell me. Where are, where are your colleagues? You must tell me where, you where your colleagues are. Your colleagues? My colleagues? Colleagues. Colleagues. How, how do you it's a partner. Hold on, I think, how do you spell it? What number? C-O-L-L, and one, two, three, four. four. Yes, it's colleagues. Colleagues. Are your co it's like a partner. Yes, they are your co-workers. Ah, co-workers. Yeah, colleagues. Okay. You must tell me, Words are colleagues. 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 Oh, colleagues. Colleagues. No, no, listen. Colleagues. Good, good, good. Uh, colleagues. 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 Very good. Okay. Okay, thank you. The other one. What? What you do tomorrow? What you do? What you do? What you do? I like to know what you do tomorrow. What you will do tomorrow, right? Or what you'll do. I, I like to know what you do tomorrow. What will you? No. What, what, what you do tomorrow. No, it's I like you. to know what, what you will. Yes, what you will. What you will tomorrow. No, you need the verb. Will what? Will do tomorrow. Yes, exactly. Again, again. And this not have a change. Uh, no, because the question is, will you? And you need to say, you will. If it, I would like to know what you do tomorrow. No, what if you, you say, will. I like. Because the question is, will you? All right. The indirect uh, one is, will you? Will. No, yes, you yes. will. Will you do? It's, it's, I like to know what you will do tomorrow. Perfect. Exactly. That's the one. Okay. Yay. Uh, yes. in, in, this, in this case, is move the, the answer. You always. Like the verb to be. Uh -huh, exactly. Exactly. <clears throat> to what should the will tomorrow? No, it will come after the tomorrow. Okay. I like to know what to you will tomorrow. No, sería así. No. 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 You need what? an affirmative statement. For example, how? Give me an example using will. Um, tomorrow I will go to work. Very good. Now instead of saying I, say you. Tomorrow you. Tomorrow you will go. Uh -huh. You will go. So what is the structure for the question? Uh, will you? No, no. You will go. So what is the structure? <clears throat> I want to do know. You, do you will go? No, not with do, like because it. do is the verb. 
Okay, give me I a... like to know what you will do tomorrow. Exactly, you will do. You will go, you will do, you will do. You will do. You will do, exactly. Because do is not an auxiliary. In this case, you. it's a verb. I will go, I will do. Is that clear, Mr. Garcia? Sorry, teacher. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm saying do is not an auxiliary in this case, it's a verb. I will do homework tomorrow, for example. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, I will, uh -huh. I will do. What yes, exactly. you do will. What you will do. What you will do. do. What, do. what you what? do. You will, will do. do tomorrow. You will do. will do tomorrow. Yes, you will do. What you will do tomorrow. Study, you will do. Okay, it's a verb, it's a verb, not, not an auxiliary. Okay. That exercise was difficult, right? A little complicated. Give me the answers, everyone, quickly, answers. Okay. Uh, what's the answer for this one? Where are my documents? I want to know. I want to know where my documents are. Where my documents are. Very good. Next, um, Mr. Castillo. You must tell me. Where are you, Carlos? Where? You, you need to change, change the order. Where? Where are you, Carlos? Where are your are. colleagues? Colleagues. Colleagues. Are. Are. Very good. Yes. Okay. Next, uh, Jenny. I like to know what will you tomorrow? Okay, no, but Do? remember after what? Hold on, after what? We have the subject. Subject. subject after what? What is the subject? You. You. So what you will tomorrow. Will. Will, but we need a verb. Do tomorrow. Do, exactly. I would like to know what you will do tomorrow. You will do tomorrow. Yes, this is the statement. You will do. All right. Next, Miguel Angel. Okay. What is about Tom? Yeah. He wants to know. Yeah, Mr. Garcia, help me. He wants to know. He wants to know what. <laughs> Do uh, uh, no. what? Uh huh. Now we need the subject. Subject. What? But you. Now you. I need the you verb. Know. Verb. You know. You know. No. You, know. No. you know. no. You do. No. No auxiliary in this no. case. Okay. Oh, about you Tom. About Tom. This is a statement. All right. Next. Katya? I don't know how much it is. It is. It is. Very good. Jenny? Okay. KD? Katie, you're muted. How much costs it? How much oh. it costs? Tell me how much it costs. Yes, and you need letter S because now this is affirmative. Okay. I will give you the answer for the last two, but practice, guys. Okay. Practice after class with this exercise. Okay. I must know when you will come back okay when you will come back 
Yes, yeah, when you will come back. And what are you going to do this afternoon? Oh, I'm going to go to the park. So she wants to know what you are going to do this afternoon. Okay. Those are the answers. But practice, guys. Uh, do this exercise after class. All right. Analyze it a little bit more. And tomorrow we'll continue practicing. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Don't get frustrated. Okay. <laughs> we'll continue practicing. All right. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. Have a nice Bye. day. Bye. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.